A new man passing by. Life is good. Best I've ever felt. Hi friends. Sorry, didn't mean to look away right when I turned the camera on. I am shut in the garage right now. I am heading to Costco right now. It is not our normal Monday Costco run and Jason's not with me. Um, but we can't avoid going. Um, and we're trying to get back to Monday schedule going to Costco. So I'm going today. Just started to rain, which is kind of a bummer. And I had an idea of something to do today because it it's gonna rain all day. It's kind of a big bummer. Abby is homesick still. Kaylee's home, she's in bed. She's not sick, I just don't know what her schedule it is for today. She just does her thing, which is fine. <laughs> she's an adult. But I had it in my head as an idea to get ready for, well I don't even know if we've mentioned it here. We're going to switch rooms for the girls when Kaylee moves out because there's no point in keeping her big bed in her room. Sorry, hang on, nose is itchy. There's no point in keeping her room, her bed in that room or a large dresser for one girl. I don't know, they might keep the dresser. Well, no, we're leaving the dresser in there. Abby will get a smaller dresser in the other room. They're going to swap rooms and we're gonna take out Kaylee's bed um, when she comes back to visit on weekends and whatnot. She can either sleep on the couch, air mattress in the playroom, or um, we can actually pull out her mattress. We're gonna keep everything for now, um, just for whatever reason that we paid money for them. <laughs> so it's hard to get rid of things. But in that big process of, of cleaning out rooms and shifting them, they both want their rooms painted and they haven't been done since we moved in. And so and that was 11 years ago. So we're gonna paint, it's a big project to work on right as Kaylee's trying to move. So we're, I'm wanting to get the process started. So I wanna clean out Chelsea and Ashley's room. Kaylee is doing a really, really good job at going through all of her stuff. So I'm not worried about Abby's room. She'll start working on her stuff as well. Chelsea and Ashley's is a different story. And I was gonna do that this morning uh, before I like even got dressed. Also, I am wearing a new t-shirt. When you see me wear that cute little sweatshirt that I got in Hawaii, I'm usually wearing a clean new shirt underneath it. It's just like my little spring jacket. <laughs> um, so I am I am wearing different clothes. The jacket, that does get cleaned. But anyway, I just, I want to clean that room. I wanna declutter it. I want to go through the closets, get rid of some stuff and whatnot, uh, get that room ready to go. We're not doing it for another month or so, but um, I didn't want to do that today and wake up Abby because they share walls. So I'm running to Costco first and then I need to go to Trader Joe's. I need to finalize gift baskets for um, Ashley's teacher and for their um, office manager, front desk guru of a wonderful woman at Ashley's Elementary School, because tomorrow morning we are going to take those gift baskets to them. So, I have a few things to get at Trader Joe's to complete those. So, come with me to, now while I go to Costco, get a few basic things, and then we'll come back and we'll start to declutter Ashley's room. And I say Ashley's room because she's most of the mess. <laughs> Love her. I love her. All my kids were like this. I just have to remember that. All my kids were like this. All right, I went. You saw all that I got at Costco. It's busier than I expected it to be. Not Friday crazy busy, but usually on a Monday I can find an empty aisle to like show everything I got in my cart. People find it weird when I'm doing that. <laughs> um, but I, I didn't find one today. Um, I got some fun pens last night at Target. Jason and I went and I just, and they write on like dark paper too, which is kind of cool. Not that I do that, but Chelsea wants to borrow them. I thought that would be kind of fun. I'm a pen girl. I love pens. 
after I went to Costco, I ran to Trader Joe's and I got this cute bottle of lemonade, even though I actually almost got a bottle of, that's horrible lighting, of uh, actual pineapple juice to go in Ashley's teacher's little basket. We're going tomorrow to take them. And so, um, anyway, but I, the bottle was really little. It was the same price as this big one, and I just thought this looked cuter in the basket. And I also got this cute little thank you card. Inside, I'm gonna cut out the little pineapple quote logo, if you guys remember that. But I also, as you saw, there's a jug of milk. Abby's the only one here to help me bring in the groceries. So I just put them inside that doorway there from the car and she brought them into the house. And uh, but she, she's really still feel, feeling sick. Is this even gonna fit? <laughs> but that goes in the basket too. Cause this, this is the creme de la creme, is the pineapple. So I'm gonna work on those after I put all the rest of the groceries away. She literally like put the food away from in here, got her medicine and went back to bed. I feel bad. And we're literally down to no breakfast drinks. Melatonin was on, almost a lot of these things were on rebate. Melatonin was on rebate. Um, trying to think, some of the things that I got that I don't normally get, like the Cheez-Its were on rebate. Stri strawberries are back in like a decent price range. Um, so I got two of those. Where'd that? Oh, I got blueberries because they're finally coming back in season. Um, not, they're still like a dollar fifty more than I normally spend, but I just decided to get those because they're they're good for you and not get apples this time. So, but it, there were a few things that were on rebate that I decided to get this time in addition to my regular list. But I'm gonna hurry and put all this stuff away um, so that I can actually like go upstairs and start working on Ashley's room. I kind of don't want her home. Not that she's going to prevent me from throwing things away or from donating things. I think it'll just be less hassle in general to not have her help me. <laughs> Maybe the aftermath she can help me put things back away or something. But I've got a podcast playing or ready to play in my ear. So I, I think I'm just going to be ready to go up there and I don't think it's going to take me long at all. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to go do that now. I'm kind of motivated and uh, have a couple hours before the kids are home from school. Poor thing. That goes upstairs. All right. So I have this. I should have shown it to you before I put the plastic bag on it. But it looks really cute in there. I've got the Legos, the straws, the cups, the lemonade. And I wrap this little... Um, I don't know, little wooden bead chain. Got the licorice, the pineapple gum, um, face wipes, pineapple, and I think that's it. I'm gonna attach the card to the outside of the bag so the girls can sign that. But I guess you take a blow dryer and you shrink wrap the plastic and then you tie the top. And I guess this is a bow. These are like different than, I don't know how to do this, so. Um, there's no instructions on how to do the bow, so I'm going to find my blow dryer. I think I have one and then see if this will work. All right, this is gonna be noisy, but I'm gonna see if this works. Well, I guess that does work. It kind of sucked it in without melting it. So, I don't know. Now I'm gonna tie it off with a little bow or string or something. There's not quite enough on the pineapple side, so I gotta figure it out. Okay, that one is all done. Oh, I like it, it's super cute. So I will undo this little bow and let the girls sign it. I decided to not leave the card folder on it because I think that just looks like really really cute. I know it's lemons not pineapples on there but the colors are all the right vibe and it just says thank you right on top. So 
Aside from the card, this is all done, and now I'm gonna do this one. And I got this cute card, because it was in blue, and it goes with that. So, I'm gonna try and figure out how to like stand this up, fluff it up a little bit, um, and add to it. I figured out the bow. You just pull on the string from this little open end on the, I don't know, you just pull on the string, and then stick that out right up there. Look at that, it looks like I've got this professionally like packaged and I didn't, I did it by myself. Okay, I have to go buy more of these shrink wrap bags from the dollar store before they get rid of them. It literally like cinches straight to the basket down here. Look at that, look how tight that is. It is so good, it works out so well. And uh, anyway, I'm very pleased with these. This one is obviously like really, really cute. If I had found some more stuff from like Trader Joe's today, I would have gotten it for her bag, but I just couldn't find anything that kind of went with it. So either way, I am, oh, I have to put the bow on that one. Where is it? Down here. And I am very happy with how they turned out. Okay, it is time. <laughs> I'm gonna get a good before and after. This isn't a throw my kids under the bus. Ashley's still a kid. Chelsea's a teenager. She's liking to have things a little bit more neat and you know, composed. This one could care less. <laughs> I don't even think I'm going to clean her bedding today. I'm just literally going to declutter. So here's a before right here. <laughs> Abby just showed this to me. <laughs> this is ridiculous. She has a can collection. I don't know why. I mean, she keeps that organized, right? Yeah, I don't know why. I don't know why. I don't know. But she's doing well with her drawers when she actually puts away her clothes. I mean, this is because she doesn't want to find a hanger. I wonder where they're at. I, like, I wonder where they're at. <laughs> but she is doing a fairly good job with the drawers. So, all right. Here is their closet. Um, honestly, a lot of this is what I want to declutter. I had, I don't know why I want to keep that. I don't know what's in those bins. A lot of the clothes need to get decluttered and donated. This is, I mean, for the most part, I'm pretty sure this is stuff that she definitely likes and wears. I just, anyway, here's a before of the closet. Here's Chelsea's side. I think these are just memorabilia. Maybe I'll put these out in the playroom and I'll sort them if I get time at the very end, but I am gonna take them out of the closet. Here's Chelsea's clothes, rainbow order. Look at my kids. But it'll be nice for Chelsea to have a better like drawer system for herself. Um, I think we're gonna leave the bigger. Abby and Kaylee have a really big, tall dresser in their bedroom. And I don't wanna move that sucker. It's big, I think the back is falling off of it. So we're gonna leave that one in there and we're gonna leave this in here. Abby will use a smaller one because it's just her, but that tall one will give three and three for each of the girls. And that way Chelsea will have a better place to store her stuff down here, um, like in her own bedroom when they swap. Um, so I was just talking to Abby about how she kinda wanted to arrange the room in here. Okay, I'm gonna do before and afters of each area that I clean, declutter, whatnot. But I gotta put this down to get going, turn on my podcast so I can kind of focus. I have changed it to shorts because the jeans were falling off and I'm getting too hot. So we're gonna get going here. We're gonna start with the dresser. She likes to collect things. I don't know, so much of it is just garbage. So, okay, here's the before, after, <laughs> not bad. These two guys go to my bedroom. I'm gonna clean this guy and use it. And that is a roller set that just goes in my bathroom. But otherwise, she's got her little collection of lotions here and her precious perfumes that she's collecting and lotions and bath washes. She keeps them here unless she goes to use them so that people don't steal them, <laughs> apparently. So, got those looking nice for her to use. I'm not sure why the go-go squeezes are up here. That one's opened, so that's probably gone bad. So I'm gonna take that one down. 
Um, maybe I can convince her to just eat that one, have it gone tonight when she gets home. But for the most part, this one was all um, kind of straightened up, so not bad. Okay, that's done. I will wipe everything down in a bit, but we're just decluttering and I need to move on. Chelsea's here to help me. No, just I'm kidding. Not, Her stuff is not the problem. I even checked underneath your bed. It's mostly just stuff from Ashley. Yeah, there's nothing underneath your bed. All right, so here's where I'm at so far. I'm gonna <gasps> That's where go through these. Went. It was in your pocket of your black pants. What? Yeah, your black oh. jeans. Hello. Oh. So I am washing. At, in fact, will you go and put move her bedding to the dryer for me, please? Anyway, I know you're gonna go down and eat anyway. Yeah. Go do that. I know. I hear you. So I, I am washing the top sheet. She's just permanently like discolored the top of this. It's just dirty. I, I do need to clean it, but I'll do it another so time. I will make it look cuter once I get the top zipped back on. Um, and for whatever reason, I have had this washed and sitting on the stairs and then sitting at the end of her bed for months now. And I finally just put it on the pillow. So it's just a pillowcase. But um, once it's all put back together, we'll put the, the uh, little... Animals on there cute. This is clean. Who remembers who gave us this cutie? She was shoved clear down and I need to have her put up on display. She just got kind of shoved down along with cute little squishmallows here. I do want to ask Ashley if she wants to keep all the squishmallows. That one's a good airplane one. Um, she is starting to give some of them away as you saw. And don't mind the dirty nasty pillow. That is what it is. And I need to find the actual Insta, Insta, Instax, is that what it's called? To put into that, like I said, I don't have to worry about Chelsea's, her stuff. I, she won't get rid of that pillow. I have given her, is this the brand new pillow? Yeah, that's her brand new pillow. She won't get rid of that. <laughs> it's the nastiest pillow ever. She won't get rid of it. And they don't sleep underneath, she doesn't sleep underneath the, the blankets. Ashley finally like decided to, but Okay, so I think I have time. I'm going to go through these bins, see what's in there. This is trash. These blankets were sitting on top of an empty bin. So now I need to wash those and decide if I'm keeping those. Those are baby blankets. This is a donate pile with books and coloring books and whatnot. Decide if we're going to donate the Squishmallows. And this is clothes, dirty clothes, miscellaneous, cups, bowls, hangers, all that kind of stuff. You can't even see how big it is. It's their regular hamper and it's chuck full. So this is the aftermath that I have to kind of deal with. But okay, I'm going through these bins and the first bin was all garbage. Just old baby swimsuits, um, things that I decorated their room with and just parts to, to whatever you call it. Whatever. There was just garbage. If you were to give this to Kayla, she would cry. I know. So I'm going through this. put it on her desk or something. I know. I'm going to. But this bin is like all her preschool like stuff. And Look so at I'm this gonna masterpiece. I know. I mean, it looks just like her. <laughs> pretty sure it's an ant or oh, spider. Okay. I don't know what it is. It'll Some of it is kind of cute. Dreams. I'll show you the one little binder down in there. But for the most part, we're just tossing it. If it's just like generic stuff like this kind of stuff, we're just tossing it. But we did find this cute little card um, that my mom wrote. To Kaylee, I miss you. Here is your calendar. It shows you when you come to my house in Utah. I gave you some six stickers so you can count the days. I am excited. I love you. Love, Grandma. The, there are some extra stickers, too. So, I'm pretty sure she will cry with that. So, I'm going to put that on her she desk. She refused to get rid of the chocolates, so I think she will I know. Cry. The cr chocolates that Grandma sent her. Okay, I am done. It was fun to talk to Chelsea. I've been listening to a podcast. Um, got everything here straightened out. I have this on the bed so we can eventually come up and vacuum. Um, her desk is always neat. She kind of keeps things on the counter here. Um, and then closets. Everything on top is completely gone now, which is super wonderful. Except for this little backpack here. She does still use that every once in a while. She's going to go to her friends. I can't find the camera for that, but I've got that case for that. I don't know if they're going to use these little lights or maybe I save them and put them in like my craft bucket, like house decor or whatever, and save it for like maybe a party or something. 
maybe I'll take that down. But I've got all of her clothes up here. One, so that we can put the hamper in the closet. And um, when I, usually it's right here. But I'm gonna put the hamper in the closet. In fact, I have this. You can actually put this in here when they're not using it. Come on. Oh, it's plugged in. So that was my phone. So, um, anyway, they can keep that in the closet, keep it out of the way. I want their hamper in the closet. Chelsea's side over here. She's going to declutter her clothes if she, I don't think she has many because she's already kind of done it lately, but this is, I mean, she, I don't think she's going to have to declutter a ton. It's only clothes in here. She might do something with a few things down there, but I'm going to let her choose. Um, but like I said, that is completely empty there. Um, this is an award from her. I don't know what that's for, but when we do do the room, the lights will come down. All of these little birds will come down. This whole shelf will come down because Abby does not want it up. Um, so then we'll take the pictures off. Um, obviously everything off the walls, we do have to kind of fix up some of the holes and stuff, tape off the ceiling. I think we need to paint the ceiling and paint the walls. So it's kind of a big job, which is why I wanted to kind of get this part done. And I'm not even done yet. I'm going to take all that kind of stuff off like middle of June. Um, so I'm not going to do it now. So. And what people don't always show you is the aftermath <laughs> donation. We are going to ask Ashley in an hour if she wants to donate these. This is my laundry dirty dishes pile. It's gotten bigger since Chelsea got home and added her clothes. And I just started chucking things down here. It's a donate pile, garbage pile, uh, garbage cans that I need to wash out. I tossed one there, one downstairs. So... I'm not done yet, which is why I'm going to be done in here. This is good enough. I'll bring the vacuum up later on. We'll vacuum this floor. This floor, um, this poof will likely go when Kaylee moves out because um, the other kids don't tend to use it. For this space, they'll just sit on the couch, which I actually would prefer. Um, and I think I've already gone through all the blankets that were over here. Um, I think we're just left with some good ones, um, but kind of make this space looking better. Also, I'm not sure. Well, yeah, she still has plants in here. I'm not sure if she's taking her plants or how many. Yeah, she's got some alive. I don't know if she's going to take them. I would assume so, but if they don't have good sunlight in their apartment, I'm not sure what they're going to do. So, but I would like to get this cleaned up. I, this is her space. She wanted it, so I, I, need, I leave her responsible for it, and the plants are hers. I don't do anything with them. So I need to now go downstairs and deal with the messes that I have created, but I will be taking this stuff to Goodwill tomorrow. I, if Ashley wants to go play with someone today, I'll take it today. The line was pretty long when I was over there today by Costco. But maybe it's died down now because I'm not keeping this stuff in the house. I'm not going to keep it in a pile in the garage. I'm not going to keep it in my in my trunk. It needs to go. I want to be done with it. Okay, I think we did good. I'm I'm glad I did all that without Ashley here because my, you know, I would have gotten anxious that she wasn't helping me or she wasn't throwing things away that should have gotten thrown away. I got to make the decisions and now she gets to choose which squishmallows will go. Those are the only choices she has to make. Echo off. All right. It's been a few hours. I've done editing. I have made, well, Costco made <laughs> some of the world's best mac and cheese. Um, everyone likes this. It's quite round on top. So we're going to leave that in there. Everyone likes to eat this for dinner. Like everyone is a great option. So I made that. Let's see. I'm trying to think how many people are here. Kaylee's still not home. Jason's about to walk in the door. I'll use some ranch for someone to have some veggies. Um, I'm still seeing, I mean, to just take you through some of my cleanup. I, I, I was filming 
I was editing the video and I was like, okay, where did I leave off? <laughs> what part of the day did I leave off with you guys? This is the second garbage can from upstairs that I have cleaned. The other one is upstairs already. I already cleaned that one. And then here in the laundry room, we have that load of laundry done from what I brought down from Kaylee and Abby's, Ashley's room. I have already put on her bedspread onto her bed. Let's go up and did you have you gone up to see your room? You like it? Do you say thank you, mom? Yes. Actually, here's the garbage can. All clean. We're gonna put some bags in these because I'm so sick of it getting so gross in the bottom of them. Maybe I shouldn't even put it back. We're not even gonna put it back until there's a bag in it. <laughs> well, I was gonna show you how cute it is and I had it all, <sighs> I had it all looking cute. Mm. <laughs> it's staying in. You do it, it stays in. And I'm gonna increase the sound no! to make That's sure people, <laughs> well, all right, fine, I won't do that. Um, well, I did have it looking all cute. <laughs> <laughs> she already climbed it. I don't know why she even climbed inside. Because she didn't even like stay here. She just messed it up. And then left. And then left. Yeah. But, oh. well, there's the, you need to woof the blanket there? I'm Goodness. You. I'm leaving. Well, there's her uncute bed all done up. All right, well, <laughs> oh, double whammy in there. I have thrown out the trash. I have put all the, in fact, I'll go out there right now and prove to you. This is motivation for you guys. Also, I have their cards set out here for the kids to sign. I did this cute little pineapple here. And it says, be, be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown, and be sweet on the inside. And I'm gonna add, I wrote down what I was gonna say to the teacher. And I say this just because, one, it goes with the theme of this little pineapple thing. But also like the, to show appreciation for the teacher and what she's done for Ashley. Um, thank you for being such a great teacher for Ashley this year. You showed her how to stand tall, how to wear her own, wear your own crown, and what it means to be kind. She is very ready to head to middle school now. So I just kind of pre-wrote that and I'll write it on the card here. But I'm actually thinking, I haven't checked Jason's location yet, but I just want to make sure I have everything put into my car to donate because I will take it tomorrow after I take the kids to go drop that stuff off. I didn't bring my phone out here. Ah, I'm not going back in. It is in there. Can you even see? Look, see, there you go. All right, that's proof. There's the bags. All that stuff is in there. And then this stuff. Oh, actually I'm going to donate this stuff. So I'm going to donate the bin and this stuff in here. So this is a cute little grill chart that I never actually put up. And then I'm assuming, oh, Abby, A-B-B-Y, and then I'll be still Kaylee. So I got the one for Kaylee when she was born. And then I went back to the same place and got the letters for Abby after I had her. So maybe I should see if they want these. I don't know. This is just a sign that I'll donate as well. This is all trash. Oh my gosh, I can't open it. <laughs> this is all just trash I need to put into the recycle bin. But I keep coming out to the garage to put this in the car and I keep forgetting to bring my, my phone. <laughs> so I can't open the car. So I can't lift the, gar the recycle to put that in. So I keep doing the same thing. Like this is the third time I've come out here to take care of it and I forget to bring my phone to unlock it. I thought Jason would be pulling up any second. But we're gonna enjoy dinner. Maybe I'll see if Jason has any kind of a reaction to their room. We might sign off with you guys tonight. See you guys tomorrow and uh, go along our day another day. It's good mac and cheese.